Hello, I'm Andy and I'm going to read to you a program called Weekly Horoscope from December the 30th to January the 5th, 2019. And this is for you coming from Leo. Well, many of you are asking for my contact, so I'm going to read to you my email address right now. It's andyhoro9 at gmail.com. A-N-D-I-H-O-R-O, the number 9, at, g- at gmail.com. Send me a message if you like. Now let's talk of Sunday the 30th for you coming from Leo. It starts in a very nice way and you're going to be very lucky in whatever you do. So mix your Sunday morning, afternoon, although it might be a holiday. Be with people you work with, be people you do business with. Mix up all that with the people you love together as well. It's going to be a very enjoyable and productive. All you don't have to do is to be dominating, that's all. Evening nightfall planets are very slow, which means that your evening nightfall plans can be cancelled, they can be postponed, things can go very wrong, there is disappointment planned for you. So if you don't have to be out, don't. Your exposure to risk will be less when you are at home. But if you have to be out, tell yourself, don't be expectant to get what you want. That way you won't be getting too upset if you don't get what you want. And be choosy of the company you keep. If you see people that you know from the past who are going to make trouble, move away from there and go home early. Monday the 31st is going to be a terrible morning afternoon for you. It's a working day, a business day. Things are going to go very wrong and all because you're either too daring or you are definitely a person who is impulsive, impatient and hasty. And you become a non-conformist, which means you don't have respect for rules and regulations. All these things bundled up and making your morning, afternoon, exposing yourself to risk, whether job, whether business, whether finances, whether with the people you're having lunch with or whether you're dealing with your people you love. So upsets are seen. Evening nightfall period, a little bit better. A little bit better because there are some good planners there who are aggressive, but they are aggressive because they want to help you and get things done for you. So take the soft approach with this aggressive pleasant the planets and you will do better. But the morning afternoon planets of rebelliousness will also go in the evening nightfall. So you will get this attitude of being rebellious and aggressive as well. Take the soft approach throughout the whole day and you'll tame these planets. Tuesday, the 1st of January, is an excellent morning afternoon. It's probably a holiday. And if it's not a holiday and if you're working, you're going to do something very good. And whoever you are with, wherever you are, what you say and do, people respect. There's one planet there that might make you a little bit arrogant. Don't let that happen. But it's going to be an enjoyable morning afternoon period for you. Evening nightfall, be cautious that planets are speeding up, going very fast. So they make you impatient and hasty and they make your tongue speed up as well so you get argumentative as well. And the trouble is that this evening nightfall period they bring miscommunication, miscalculation all because you are at your top speed on saying and do things. So slow down what you say, slow down what you do and you'll control these planets. Planet plans can change in evening nightfall so be cautious. Wednesday the 2nd of January starts nicely for you. But too many emotional planets there and it's a working day or it's a business day. So use these three words to pull yourself back back into action in job or business. And the three words are logic, facts and figures. That will remind you, you have to use logic and you have to depend on facts and figures, not depend on emotional ways. So be careful, morning, afternoon, too many emotional planets thinking of the lunch you're going to have or the evening what you're going to have or the romance what you want to chase. Your deadlines will go all awry and you will have many, many difficulties. Evening, nightfall, not good. These are planets that make you too different in your approach or your ideas or your speech or your action to people. They make you arrogant as well. And they make you a person who is disagreeable. These are planets who want to put wedges between you and other people. So the best way to tackle these planets is to be appreciative and supportive of everyone. That way you will do better. Thursday the 3rd for you coming from Leo, 24 hours of good luck. Morning and afternoon you can meet very important people, get very good news in job, very good news in business. There's a planet of expansion, they want to expand what you're doing, make you more powerful, making you more great. So allow all that to happen. 
talk to people about your plans your bosses talk to the business people you are dealing with about your plans you'll see that they will back you and they'll support you there's one planet there that can make you a little dominating quieten that planet down a bit by not showing domination evening and nightfall i see global planets there and these global planets of course they are the planets of the internet so go on to the internet in the evening nightfall period and you will see the chances of getting the lead into the job you want somewhere in the world the business you want somewhere in the world the romance you might find somewhere in the world and the friendship as well so all that's waiting very positively for you to find and if you're not going to be on the internet you'll still be very happy in doing it because the planets of the evening nightfall are wonderfully placed to help you and make you happy you might even meet people of other races who will then talk of travel and holidays friday the 4th is going to be 24 hours of bad news morning afternoon the worst these are planets that make you a non-conformist you don't obey rules and regulations your ego is bigger than your head and that's not good and so because of that you will be a person who upsets everybody by what you say and what you do and that's going to bring blame unexpectedly and these planets of unexpectedness are totally bad so it's not only totally bad news but unexpected even worse so what do you do be part of a team at your place of work be part of in business as well you don't want to stick out like a sore thumb like a sore thumb or you will look like a sore thumb be part of a team and you'll find that slowly you can maintain this carefulness that you need in what you say what you do slow down in speech slow down in action don't be impulsive impatient or hasty evening and night fall slow planets take over and they will frustrate you hour by hour they are unraveling things going wrong in all areas of your life bad news comes past issues also troubling you you might meet people in the past you don't like and they'll come and say hello to you and so if you don't want to expose yourself to risk stay home but if you have to be out tell yourself be careful and be very choosy what you say what you do and who you are seen with at all as well so because disappointment is waiting for you evening nightfall period and morning afternoon period saturday the 5th for you coming from leo doesn't start too well in the morning afternoon stress is seen anxiety is seen too many things to do you are under pressure you get argumentative you lash out with words which are very sharp and fiery well that's a recipe for making sure that you get your morning afternoon totally bad do the opposite be a be appreciative be supportive be flexible and most of all use words which are soft evening nightfall turns much better for you and be careful drive slowly throughout the whole day evening nightfall much better for you except that the morning afternoon periods also come there so they make you say and do things and make promises without thinking and they make you a person who can be very argumentative evening nightfall but i like the planets of evening nightfall because they are determined to get you what you want but that determination is not good because you go like a bull in a china shop to get what you want why don't you take the soft approach throughout the whole day especially evening nightfall you still get what you want in a much classier way and that would be nice okay well i am already having the 90 minute session to help you in your next 7 8 or 9 years that will cost you usd 50 it will be based on your date of birth time of birth and looking at your palms and i'll give you a lot of personal information like your personal lottery numbers your personal lucky days and your lucky colors and your lucky directions and your lucky gemstones a lot of information so that you can get your next 7 8 or 9 years as perfectly poised as possible well until then thank you and good luck and by the way uh, if you want to contact me on skype my skype address is all talk 1943 a l l T A L K one nine four three all together at Skype. I hope to hear from you, and I've already given you my email address. Thank you and goodbye.